Ah, Sonic Adventure. That big old dreaded jump to 3D. Oh boy, how the 64-bit era had its time nailing franchise after franchise on the backside. Earthworm Jim and Castlevania stand out most of all as some of the heavier sufferers from the transition. And there was a lot of worries to how the blue blur would handle the big shift. Seeing from my personal experience with the game, I can say that it definitely handled it better than most. And as a kid, I'd insist that it's one of the best 3D titles ever made. But speaking today, while it's definitely not a bad game per se, it is the literal definition of a mixed bag. Removing the emphasis on building momentum and utilizing speed as a reward for playing well, which is seen in the Genesis titles, that was thrown out the window, with the main focus on the main stage is centering entirely on speed. Tap the controller stick forward and you just shot 50 feet forward, and the only thing to slow you down is the introduction of an overworld, later removed in the second adventure title, and the Chow Garden, later renovated in the second adventure title. Unfortunately, with such agility-driven setup, at the time where 3D was a major step into Misty Waters, it suffered severely from glitches and clipping. But as a whole, Sonic Adventure was a bold step in a new direction, adding story elements and new characters that seriously changed the play style of the games, something that would impact the Sonic franchise for better or for worse for years to come. Fun fact, a lot of people were pretty shocked when they first ran through the forested segments of the Mystic Ruins in the overworld, mainly because of how realistic they looked. So how did the Dreamcast accomplish it, with actual images? A majority of the forests you see in Sonic Adventure were actually photos taken by Sonic Team as they traveled all around the world and later pasted as textures. For the Dreamcast era, one thing that really sticks out with this title is that it's gorgeous, and it's a testament to good game design as to how Sonic Team managed to work around system limitations to really make something that blew people away at the time and still looks great today. Sonic Adventure 1. We're playing this. We discussed this priorly on our yay, Sonic Yay, readers. yay, yeah. Don't fag it up. Sorry, I was just Don't singing. Bag it up, dude. Dude. Don't. No. Bag shut up. It up. You're fucking it up. Gosh. I'm not doing anything. Did you see that? Okay. Here's how. Yes, I, I saw Nukles. Here's how this one. Start. I know Did how to know? play this game. I fucking, played it for no, years. No. Hard drive. Okay. Saving it to hard drive. Why didn't we do this before we started recording? Because I don't fucking care. Selective. Uh. No. No. It's. It's. Uh. Down. <laughs> down. That one, that one. It doesn't go any further than that. That one. Oh, oh I thought like it was played for four no. hours. No. Okay. So here's it started at four in the morning. Oh, shit. It's already four, really? No. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. It's actually 4.53. Are you serious? <laughs> well, damn. Character. Who are we going to be? Uh, the only character you can be? I'm going to be E102 Gamma. Because Y stands for Gamma. Dude, you're so intelligent. I know, I know it's a symbol. I was trying to be funny. Clearly that did not go through. Well, I just, I don't know. God, I haven't played this in years. This game is amazing. Are we gonna skip cutscenes? Let's just skip cutscenes. Yeah, because I think... People... Let's just not talk about it, let's just do it. Okay, skipped. Uh, I'll paraphrase what happened, because I remember it so well. Blue guy comes out, he's like... Police are like, shit. Now I gotta fight him. Sonic's like, you're blue. In the story, that's that's how it was. Oh yeah. And now he's fighting Zero. Did I really just say Zero? Uh, Chaos Zero. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're thinking Amy's story, bro. Look at those <clears throat> awesome ass water effects. <laughs> and now, oh yeah, I forgot how the camera sh shifts at random. Did you see the shitty fucking camera that went under the hey, under the floor? Uh. <laughs> Okay, this doesn't count as a level, though, because we agreed that I had to... Oh, it's level. my turn, okay. No, fuck you. We did Paper, Rock, Scissors earlier. Two out of three. <laughs> you played 23 seconds and 70 milliseconds. That was my turn. No! Fuck off! <laughs> I get the first level. That was the agreement. Bro, the first level's amazing. Okay, I'm gonna skip this one, but... Come on, you big I think drip. that's the greatest line in the history of game dialogue. Come on, you, you big, big drip. drip! And then Eggman is all like... Chaos! And uh, Sonic's like, oh, okay. And then Shadow comes out of nowhere. Like, okay, Control! that's not until Sonic Adventure 2. You were very confused. I'm so. <laughs> oh, the first level of the piece of shit. You know, this is kind of fun right here, just because. Uh, I don't know if it's a shout out, but if you've ever seen the Sonic OVA, which. Was, have you ever seen that one? The old Sonic OVA movie, which was released in America, what? with the tagline of tails? scrape your knuckles, catch some tails, and was by far the worst pun in the world, but <laughs> it was a really good movie with a decent dub. No, I haven't seen it. Oh, it's really good. It's uh, What's it called? It's uh, literally called Sonic OVA. They called it Sonic the Movie when it came to the shores. And it was interesting because Sonic talked a lot like this. Oh, hell it was no. Like, <laughs> but dude, it sounds weird, but you get used to oh, it. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah, thing. look at those poorly pixelated asses. You're not even looking at the asses. You're looking at the front. A plane crashed over there at the beach. Look at the ass. 
Okay, let me try to get this. Oh, jeez. Wow, I, I forgot how top-notch the camera work is on oh, this. Oh, man, did you see that pixel? Oh, yeah, I just want to drown myself to death. <laughs> <laughs> so hot. Uh, how are you alive? You just went in the water. I'm Mr. Know-It-All. Here's a clue. Grab the spinning rings. It's important. Okay, did he have to mention they were spinning? What spinning? What the fuck is he talking Okay, this about? guy suffers from cerebral palsy or something. Look at his arms. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing with Sonic games. They, they move their arms to talk for like Welcome to ever. Emerald Coast. Good to know. Hey, wait, we live on the Emerald Coast. Oh shit, we do. We are a part, <laughs> we're like part Sonic. Fuck, Sonic's on our coast right now, dude. That's pretty rad. Okay, oh. For those that actually care about the story and instead of playing the game themselves or watching this for some deranged, demented reason, well, Tails crashed. For, for anyway, if you haven't played this game yet, you shouldn't even be watching, really, because... Yeah. Really? This game is You're like... not gonna get... This is more just out of nostalgia, because it's been forever since we've played it. This isn't going to be one of those walkthroughs where we're gonna 100% it or anything. This is just for fun. I don't... Are we even gonna 100% it? Well, I, I would nah. like to do it. Well... Yeah, I We still... gotta... Let's just... Co uh, we're gonna have an episode called Big, and I think we're just gonna... Well, we can discuss this afterwards, you know. Uh, I guess. I mean, I, I, I did like wanna... the idea of having each... Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Sonic Adventure glitches, dude. This game is very glitchy. Even as a kid, I remember it being extremely glitchy, especially when you have to outrun the orca. Oh my god! Speak of the devil. I know. Well, speak of the orca. I mean, what are you doing? Run fast! Gotta go fast, dude. This isn't Sonic X. <laughs> this is Sonic Adventure. Sonic I, X is a TV show. I actually heard the Japanese opening of Sonic X. It was pretty good. Dude, the English opening was great. Go, Gotta go, go, fast. go, 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 Gotta go, go fast. Gotta go fast. Fuck the shit out faster, of that opening. Faster, 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 faster. Now, ba -na 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 -na. You know, one thing I'll say is the level things aside from rooftop run. The music wasn't that remarkable in the levels for this game. You know what I realize right now? Sonic that 06. the controls don't hold up as well as I remember them as a kid. Sonic 06 is, um... 10 out of 10 game? Best game you ever played in your entire life? Yeah, I mean... Even though I've never played it, and I don't know if you've ever played it. I've played it. No, um, Sonic... How do I remember all these hidden paths and shit? It's been years. I think years. you didn't mean to do that. No, I did. Uh, like, everything's okay. coming back subconsciously. Anyways, as I was saying, Sonic 06 started off with a... With a beach level also. So well, I forget if it gets better or not. I remember that, you know, this one's really glitchy. Are we even going to bother with Chow's in this? Maybe, um, maybe yeah, off we, camera. Yeah, we should have a whole whole episode dedicated. Because it takes, like, 10 to 20 hours. <laughs> That's what people want to see right there. Oh, yeah, dude. I thought we'd do this Let's Play, though. We, like, have a Sonic... Oh, yeah, I remember this. We can talk about this later, Austin. No. Yeah. Good idea. I kind of forgot about that part. I think separated by character would be a good way to do it. Yeah, we should. Because, you know, you have to jump between characters anyways. I thought we just go ahead and get Sonic's missions taken care of. Well, we can beat we do... Sonic tonight, then we no do... problem. Dolphins! I want to fuck a dolphin. My turn. Yeah, okay, you're up. You're up, bro. Let's see if you got an A. I probably didn't. Yeah, not <laughs> oh, no, wait. You don't get a grade. You have to, like, do it multiple times and it gives you different missions. Like, I think Red State Mission B is, like, beat it in a minute and 20 seconds. Oh, wait, seconds. really? Yeah, this one's different. I never actually... Oh, Sonic Adventure 2 was the same way, I think. Guys, just so you know, I can play as Tails now. I don't give a fuck. You get to play with Tails. First levels. Oh, go talk to the pink ball. Take the train to okay, I know I had to go to the Mystic Ruins. Take uh, the train the... to the Mystic Ruins. I never really did get the whole point of the overworld in this game. It wasn't like it was bad. It... But it's just like, it didn't really add anything to the experience. There was no reason for it except for just to say, well, the thing is, though, this was Sonic's big first real 3D game. Sonic 3D Blast doesn't count. So I think they were really experimenting with this one. It was a good It was a good game. I liked the overworld, actually. I don't know why. I, I, I know, I, it is relaxing. It, it's kind of nice, and it was good for the Chow Gardens. 
but you have to admit it's kind of out of place. It is out of place. Levels. Like this level or this. Uh, oh yeah, you get to fight the boss. Oh fucking a! It's all coming back to me. Okay. I miss this voice actor for Robotnik. Do they not have that one anymore? He died, unfortunately. Did he really? Yeah, he passed away. Now they use the uh, four kids VA for Eggman, who's also really good. But I was kind of attached to the guy that did him in Sonic Adventure One and Two. Dude, when did he pass away? I didn't even. It was between Sonic Adventure Two and Heroes, I think. I'm not positive though. Really? What did yeah, I'm he... pretty sure the voice actor changed in Time of Heroes. How old was the guy? Uh, I don't know. I think he was all like pretty up there. I don't think it was like he died super young or anything. Still kind of sad though, just because you know. Dude, I had no idea. Yeah. I freaking... Eggman's voice actor is always great. They've always been good at casting Eggman. He's been like the one character that's been consistently awesome in terms of voices. Sonic, not so much. What the fuck was that? I Jason just, like... Griffith was a... Wait, ah, oh, shit, maybe Miss Duggerstood. Miss... Miss Wuggerstood? I don't know how to talk nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Wugger. Wasn't Jason Griffith the one that did the four kids Sonic and this is freaking that other guy? Hey, I'll play with you some other time. I don't know. I really need to get like the names down. I can tell you like the differences between the voices of every Sonic per game, but I couldn't give you the names. I think Roger Craig Smith is who does Sonic since uh, Colors On and he does amazing. You think so? Oh yeah, I love the new Sonic voice where it's not like super deep, but it's not like, hey kids, I'm Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog. Oi, pick that up. I like it more when he kind of has a bit of a deep voice. Not like Knuckles deep, but this is a nice in between zone. You're going the wrong way, brother. Wait, oh, you're not. What? You're not. Oh shit, I'm totally you mixing shut up the levels. Fuck up, bro. <laughs> okay, just ignore me, I don't know what I'm talking about. Bro. The key is floating. I don't wow, you were so near the off pedestal. and just. <laughs> It's like, oh, guys, we'll go do that level, bro. Oh, dude, Cyclone. Oh, this level's awesome. This level is awesome. I'm glad I lost the rock, paper, scissors bet. It wasn't really... Well, I guess it's a bet if you win something, Fuck. ultimately, even if it's not It much. wasn't really a bet. Oh, shit. Well, we, we were... It was a bet. I almost died, just yeah. so you know. One thing I will say is the controls are not as good as I remember. At all. Yeah, controllers aren't that bad. Oh! <laughs> you were saying? I speak, and you know what my mouth gets me? Death. Death instantly. I'm not gonna talk anymore. It wasn't really instant. You went over, but you glitched through the side of the wall. Come on, man, this is the worst speedrun I've ever seen. Bro, I can't run fast. Hey, if you're I'll playing die. a Sonic game, aren't you always technically speedrunning? You're right. Shit. Oh, okay. It's tornado. Tornado. The Tornado. Yeah, one well, needs to hurry the fuck up. Yeah. I like how his plane's called Head the Tornado. You should be able to get Never out really of offer a reason why. It's just a tornado. I'm not sure where I was going with that statement. <laughs> it's just, I don't know, it just dawned on me that this plane's called the Tornado. It doesn't do anything remotely Tornado related. They had to call it like, I don't know, the Blue Bomber or something that's relevant to Sonic, but instead it's just a storm. Well, you know what? I don't see how that's relevant. No, I'm just saying, you know, you'd think the name of this plane would be something more related to Sonic and Tails. It just seems kind of random. I feel like if they gave Mega Man a vehicle and called it Chris Redfield, it wouldn't fit. <laughs> oh, it would fit, because it's Capcom. Well, yeah, but it's not related to the Capcom no. franchise itself, you know? Look, as much as I love to see Tails' Tails his ass. ass. I was going to say something. <laughs> I wasn't sure what to really say about that. It kind of spoke for itself. Well, yeah, but I just had to bring it to everyone's attention that Tails' ass was in my face, and I didn't like it. What are you, gay? A little bit. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> Only slightly. I forgot how, like, the pop-up was where the level you can see trying to load on the edges. Like, oh, jeez, if he gets here, we gotta be ready. But until you are right there, it's just faded, very barely visible. You get hit by a spiked ball. And then I got all my rings back instantly. That is kind of lame that they don't grade you, though, by mission. 
Yeah. I, I mean, the mission mode is cool, the way they have it, where you do it. I encourage you to play each level at least three times, but I would like if they had a separate grading system as well. That I like seeing that S whenever I pull off a really oh, good yeah, run. Dude. Oh, wait, it's A. Or is, no, it's no, A. No, S is the best. Not an Adventure 2 battle. Are you sure? I'm sure. There's an S rank, I think, in a... No. Well, in Sonic Colors, I know there's an S rank. Oh, yeah, it's because everyone uses S. Does Sonic S's. Generations use S as well? I think so. Yeah, I still need to play that one. Um, uh, speaking of Adventure 2 Battle really quick, um... We're downloading it right now. You know, you know Final care. Rush? You know the level Final Rush? I remember it, but I have to actually see it. There was always this cheat that I used. You got a Chow's Emerald! <laughs> there was always this cheat that oh, I used. Oh, look who won! Stales! <laughs> Shut up! There was always this yeah. cheat that I you used. You beat level C! God, fuck. <laughs> I'm sorry, go ahead. There was always this... Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, just slam the controller on the ground and just... There's always this cheat that I used. Like, it wasn't cheat, cheat. It was just, like, me jumping off of a cliff and landing oh, on a... Oh, these controls. Oh, so good. <sighs> I jumped off of a rail to the bottom of the level where there was another rail to finish the level. <laughs> That's what I fucking did. Fuck you, Austin. You may find okay. I will go to Station Square and see if I can find something. What the hell? Don't you dare go without me. This game is rad to the max. Way past cool. Dude, you know what we should be eating right now? Even though we just had a Waffly House? What should we be eating? Chili dogs. Let's go to Dairy Queen, even though they're closed at 5 in the morning. Actually, I think uh, Dairy Queen has the best chip. I mean, God, my fucking head. I was going to say Sonic actually has really good chili dogs. I just it just dawned on me right now for the first time that that kind of makes sense. <laughs> Bro, you went to the wrong area. It said to go here. There's oh a God, place this in, gameplay. There's a place in town where you can go to the sewer. Okay, it's... I'm sorry, I thought the sewer system <laughs> was the sewers. Bro, can I please play really quick? Yeah, you do the hub world because I really don't... I remember the levels, but the actual hub world itself is kind of vague. Fuck. Fuck, get out of my way. So says the man that gets stuck inside of Pose. <laughs> May I have Post, thank you. Shit. Pose. Oh, okay. I remember now. Do you? Because this is easy as fuck. It's been a while. Since Baby, it's cold outside. Hold my head up high. You know, it's I always. Been a while. You know, it's always weird right when Halloween ends because they start playing Christmas music right afterwards. Now you've got lights when it's cold outside. I love Christmas power. music and all of that. Once it's just. Power, it's, it's, it's weird. You know, that sense of Halloween just came and it hits you. Dude, it's gonna be Christmas in like. no time. Ready? Go! Go. I would have laughed if I fell. I didn't even have to press a button to open that door. <laughs> oh yeah, there's that egg you can bring to the chow garden to get a, like, emerald chow. And just because I can, I'm going to. Not the rock, the one inside the store. No fuck! No, don't waste shit. time. Don't waste time. We're not doing the chow garden. You're wasting... You're ruining our speed run. Says the guy who... Didn't know where the sewer was. At least I tried to look for it. I'm like someone. Because he knew where it was. Yeah, I was fucking say. Casino area. Oh, oh yeah, you gotta go to Station Square. You gotta enter the building and take a riggedy right past I'm the jail garden. All Sonic stages are really fucking good, dude. Tails isn't bad either. Admittedly, they're not very hard, though. Knuckles stages are kind of... Depends on your luck. If the uh, pieces fall in a decent area, it's not so bad, but... In Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, I can always do them really fucking quick. Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, all of them were good. And over the controller, brother, you did the tornado stage. Oh, I love this one! I know, I was saying, Sonic oh, levels are amazing. Level... Oh, no, this one specifically, though, because it's mostly slot machines. I know, all you have to do is... I like slot machines. Go in that slot machine, it's right I want the Knights there. one. Oh, shit, yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Yeah, my little brother, he got this game on, because he's a big Sonic fan as well. And he found this game on uh, the PS Arcade Live. Go to the Knights and quit doing shit. I supposed to, I have to get rings to fill the vault to go, so I'm breaking this. God. Son of a bitch. Making this difficult for me. 
That's not the knight's one. Yes, it is. That's the card and pinball. Oh, oh, it's not the knight's <laughs> one. I'm sorry, I'm clearly mistaken. I clearly you know don't know. Think... I've only played this game for freaking how many years? You know what I love about this one? It plays knight's music. Oh, I know. Which we can barely hear due to syncing issues. We have the volume on, like, bare minimum. We have no syncing issues. Austin's just being funny. <laughs> I'm being a silly billy. Oh, gosh sucks darn. At this game. Just give me a few moments, okay? It takes me a little while to figure it out. Oh, yeah! What does that even do? Uh, you have to get, like, cards and whenever you get matches. But the big goal is to try to get up there in that slot in the back. So you can get to this area where you get, like, tons of cards for free. It's like, uh, Blue Yu-Gi-Oh. Blue gi -Oh, if you will. Oh. <laughs> what was so funny, James? I didn't almost make a joke. He almost dieted. He almost dieted. He almost dieted? Yeah. Come they need to make Sonic fat again. I miss when he was kind of chubby. I'm not sure why that didn't deflect me there, but I'm just gonna ignore it. I just realized, Sonic while I love this fat. level, this is gotta be so fucking boring to watch. <laughs> All you have to do is get up there in the mare and you win. It's not as easy as it sounds, but I will try to get inside of the mare. <laughs> <laughs> what utensil of, your, or of yours are you gonna use to just get inside use my that fist. mare? Oh, you're gonna fist that mayor? Dude, when I was in California with Corey, I had this thing going where every night we have sat in a tent and I would show him some kind of horrifying, like, didn't need to know that video. <laughs> and I found this video, and I didn't even know what it was at the time, but I was like, hey, you gotta see this. And it was about an African village where the bride of passage to become a man and adopt a wife is when you were 12, every boy would fuck a donkey. I'm dead fucking serious, it's a full documentary. And... I showed it to him, but it didn't show anything. It was just the kids talking about it. So my friend was like, oh, these subtitles are probably fake. They didn't really do this. And at the end of it, one of the uh, oh, veteran yeah. donkey fuckers was like, I show you how our town work, where this happened. That's donkey right there. Good pussy, good donkey. And Corey was like, oh, God, you're not really going to do this. You're not going to show it right. And then did it and show it. They just talked about it until the very end of this, like, 20-minute interview. Then it flashes to the clip of this guy, like... 40 year old black guy with his massive fucking cock and he's fucking a donkey <laughs> and the donkey's just going rrr, rrr, and the black guy's like oh yeah oh yeah and my friend just was oh hey I'm in the special zone and my friend was just horrified <laughs> he was like why would you show this to me Austin no no and I'm laughing my ass off cause <laughs> dude I've never been here in the, all the times that I've played this game cause you're a goddamn casual who doesn't know shit about knights I went there. I said it. I don't know anything about knights. You're right. Anyways, <laughs> continue. Well, that was, I mean, that was kind of it. He got to go to sleep with the image of a black guy <laughs> fucking a donkey. <laughs> that is fantastic. I tried to remember what else. I showed him something that was equally horrible the night before. <gasps> oh, man. Whoo! You seem tired. Is that because it's 5 a.m., bro? Possibly. I'm stuck. Now I'm not. I uh, forget how many rings I need to... A lot. Oh, shit. You have a lot right yeah, now. Yeah, I know. I'm not bad at pinball games, usually. Usually it hits me a while to get in the groove, but it's actually one of those things I'm pretty good at. So, <laughs> so says I. Okay. Deposit that shit. I think you need 200. I'm, I'm lying. I, think, I don't know um, how many you need. Oh. Where does he keep his rings? How many do I need? 400. Oh. Okay, well I'm gonna do the different one now. Cause that was fun, but I want to do a different one. Oh, this camera. Godspeed. It's the best. Oh, dude, go in the shower room. Wait, isn't there another pinball machine I can do? Yeah, this card in the slot. Oh, okay, there okay. we go. I remember it. It's just, I don't know. And this one, if you die, you go into the little area. Oh, I get it. It's Sonic themed. What? No, it's not. Remember Sonic Spinball? pinball spin slot machine? Do you remember Sonic Spinball? No. You don't? No. It was so good. 
You'll never guess by the title, but it was a pinball game centered around Sonic. No, uh... Not dude. even joking. You're a liar, dude. Not even joking. Okay, continue. Well, well, let me know about this game. What's so good about it? Why'd you bring it up? Well, it was just like the graphics, this like really dark, grimy theme to it. I think it also was the only Sonic game to have characters from the Saturday morning cartoon show make appearances. I think Sally made a guest appearance in there. I'm not positive on that. It may have been a different game. I'm Did you just of. see that? Yes, you I know. Glitched. That was perfect. He licked that ring. Maybe I should have stuck with Knights. This may take a... What? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Three Amy. Oh. I like how they use the Sonic CD design of Amy on that. That's awesome. Back when she actually looked like a hedgehog. Well, by Sega standards. Sonic didn't really like a hedgehog. <laughs> Amy looks exactly like a fucking hedgehog, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna go and buy a hedgehog tomorrow. And if it doesn't look like that, I'm suing. If hedgehogs actually looked like that, furries would be the happiest group of people in the world. Oh, fuck yes! Three Sonic Speed Star. Oh man, I died for the first time. Wait, are they, what are they timing me for? I think I have like a bonus or something I gotta collect in that time slot. Yeah, you need to go in one of those slots, bro. What? I'm supposed to go to the slot machine? And the slot machine? I had no idea. Then you need to go in there. You see those things you Look, just opened? I'm trying the best I can. I only gamble once. <laughs> Yogo, you only gamble once, which means you can't gamble ever again after this, bro. Gambling's fun. Gosh darn it. I'm actually pretty good at, uh, I think it was, yeah, it was Blackjack that I played in California. <laughs> You're stuck. I Yogo. I get coins every time I hit this. We fucked up. <laughs>